All right, June 12th. Today, let's get back into the crypto space. We're going to talk about Wolf, 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 W-U-L-F. What is it and why am I talking about it? It is a Bitcoin derivative, as I like to call it. Whether, whether right or not, it's a Bitcoin derivative in that it is a Bitcoin miner. Uh, you can buy this and play off the Bitcoin price as well. It is uh, Terra Wolf is the company. They are out of Maryland. They have done quite well since the Bitcoin halving of April, having mined about 186 Bitcoin in the month of May. And uh, they are doing quite well. Yesterday, the stock was up uh, 12% at close. Today, it opened 13% up. I was going to buy back in Monday after making about 15% profit. Uh, I did not foolishly. Uh, always kind of go with your gut sometimes and your smarts, but I didn't do it. Uh, we are up hugely, again, like I said, uh, up 36% in the past couple days and not doing too bad. So this is one way to get into Bitcoin trading if you want, what, you know, without buying Bitcoin or buying an ETF. You can actually go and buy a miner. Uh, it's not one to one on the Bitcoin price. It's just its own beast, but you can you can profit from it. And the philosophy I always push is get the doubles. You're up over 10 percent or so. That's a couple bucks in your pocket. Maybe sell. And then that way you have a positive gain and you're not going to be uh, crying about losing money if you try to hold for the grand slam. Like with Tesla, I had Tesla. Oh, it's going to keep going up. Everybody loves Tesla, blah, blah, blah. No, nope, down 40%. I did not set my stop loss at my 10%. I usually do. And man, just lost 40%. I got out because I don't think people are buying EVs. But uh, I think they lost interest in that. So don't be like me. Set your stop loss and go for the doubles. So we have um, Wolf is up. Let's go over to Trading View. One of the better apps to get on your desktop. Get the desktop version. You can set your watch list over here and uh, see the real time updates accordingly. So here's Wolf. We are up, like I said, just today up 12.9%. Yesterday closed up roughly 13%. So this thing is, uh, this thing is doing quite well. It uh, has, let's see, there was some latest news coverage and you can do it on TradingView. There's a little lightning bolt here. You can click on that and see the news. What I like to do is go over here and look at that centered for you guys. And let's see, you can see right here up 12.95%, 45 cents so far on the day on a $3.93 price right now. And you can go down and see the uh, statistics and analytics and technicals on TradingView, which I like. You can see how it's done so far, not too shabby. And look at that, it's given indicators on technicals and there's more technicals too. Just go through TradingView, you can learn about any stock this way. But we're talking about Wolf. So let's go look at the news that just came out. Yeah, let's see, you click on this little lightning bolt, let's see if it works. What's going on with Bitcoin miner Terra Wolf stock? All right, and what happened yesterday too is uh, Terra Wolf coverage assumed by analyst house Cantor Fitzgerald at overweight, and they also give it a price estimate where they see this thing going. So let's see if it's in this article. 39 minutes ago. And that should take me to a website. There we go. Uh, what's going on with Bitcoin miner Terra Wolf stock today? Uh, let's see, the shares are trading higher Wednesday as Bitcoin rises after May CPI figures came in. I don't know, okay. It was that consumer price index figures. So this is the only sentence I really care about in here. On Tuesday, this analyst corporation, which I mentioned, assumed coverage of Terra Wolf with an overweight rating and raised the price target to seven bucks. That's pretty cool. So um, good stock. I think it's, it's good based on Bitcoin, based on Bitcoin mining. Uh, Bitcoin's here to stay. Uh, something to look at to look into. So this is what I'm doing with it. I did buy back in at the high here. Probably, I'm probably breaking even right now or probably down 50 bucks. Uh, I was hoping this morning it would pull back from last night's high, maybe a couple cents, you know, and buy in. But no, it opened 13% higher right off the bat. So there you go. I, my loss on that. Uh, again, I'd like to go for the doubles. I'm up. Take, take the money. Rinse and repeat. And uh, with this stock, you seem like it's just it just has only upward tra trajectory. <laughs> English heart upward trajectory to get up to that $7 price limit. 
uh, price uh, price expectation by this analyst house. But only take that for what it is. Read about them. Look at their numbers. They basically are efficient in their operation, and uh, they may be. Oh, there was one good thing here. Let's go back to that. There was something else they mentioned in that article. I wanted to show you. All right. The analyst highlighted Terra Wolf's debt reduction and second lowest gross power rates among Bitcoin miners. That's huge because the only winners in Bitcoin mine are the ones that can run efficiently, utilizing the power to the most performant they can. Uh, low overhead, high performance. That's going to be the ones left standing and the ones doing the best, most profitable. He also noted the company has 300 megawatts, milliwatt, uh, mega, I guess megawatts of power, which he expects to be utilized for AI, HPC purposes, making Terrawolf the best way to play the AI HPC theme among their coverage. That, that's actually something I didn't even consider is uh, using their basically power of their machines and that to actually tackle the AI problems, which is pretty interesting. So that's a plus right there. Added cherry on top. So there you go. That's what I want to talk about today. Terra Wolf. It was flat for a while. It went up. I was happy it went up. Took some, took some profits. I said, oh, maybe I'll buy back in. I did not buy back in Monday. If I would have, I would have got that 12% yesterday and my 13% today. <laughs> it just goes to show you. You can get the doubles, which is good because then you're not in the hole. So you, it's, all, it's all how you want to trade these things, right? But uh, you can make your doubles on this. And with a nice price target of seven, this is looking really good. And I did buy back in probably about 392. I think I'm breaking even right now for today's. Uh, there you go, guys. What do you think? Are you buying? buying this? It's a good way to get into Bitcoin. Like I said, I call it a Bitcoin derivative. It's not Bitcoin. Uh, buying Bitcoin directly and holding the coin. It's not buying an ETF. It is uh, it's buying the mining operation. So I don't know. What do you think? Let me know what you're buying. Let me know what you're trading. What do you think this is good or not? This is what I'm doing. Again, for entertainment, this is entertainment for you guys. Do not listen to any fool on YouTube about financial advice <laughs> or you'll be uh, quickly broke. Trust me. Yeah, do not do it. This is for fun. Uh, all right. I will see you guys in the next one. Boom.